There's some out here at the Malibu Autobahn. These are the most modified cars that have come in so far. 488, it's a Huracan. Huracan sounds really nice. Ooh, and a young lady's driving. Look at that. Love that. Crypto, huh? What's next? Oh, we got a few Huracans. All right. It's the STO. Huracons are so nice. Oh man. I told you that aggressive look is what really made me want to get down if you want. I had one behind me in the canyons once. There's a super bird out there. See that? The blue car? There you go, the 43. That's expensive. Where's the STO going to go? Follow that one. It's the quietest one I've heard in a long time. And that was a nice sound of C8. I don't know if you guys heard that. That's that red one over there at the light. So this is Malibu Autobahn. This is their second meet from what I understand. We're here on Sunset and PCH. Start time is eight o'clock in the morning. You park over there uh, in the um, plaza area for spectating. Don't know if there's a cost for parking or not. But if you want to be in this show, you have to be juried in, which means you got to submit your car to the guys. They pick and choose which ones they want out here. And then you pull up right here. Old school Viper. Then you pull up right here and you gladly toss over your $15 and they will gladly take it and you come in and then now you're all official and that's basically how this show works not my favorite car but this car's got a lot of records though it does and the cool thing about it is like you know i, I got out here early and uh there's no police activity but I'm really, really surprised at because in Malibu, it's just been nuts. I haven't been out here since I got a ticket, actually. Oh, I guess so. You park over there. You guys are going up there to park somewhere. I was lucky enough to park on the street or on the coast. Another young lady driving. I love that, man. I love that. I think that's so nice. I don't know what that is. Huh. A lot of Aston Martins out here. She had to bring her poodle. Maltese, that is. My dad had an Aston Martin. But I wasn't old enough to enjoy it. Well, they all did a U-turn. So I guess you don't park up here. And they are serious about turning people away, too. If you're not on the list, and they ain't got... What is that, Santa Claus? See, I like a platinum color. See that? You don't see that too many times. Another STO. If you didn't know, got my rhyming thing on today. For everything that I say. some Maseratis, regular 458. It's funny how 458 has been consumed by the details now in other cars. Like, I used to be really, hold on a sec. I used to be like really, really uh, floored by their design because I think when they came out, they really changed the game. Ferrari stepped it up. I don't know, they checked this out. We about to have some things that turn some heads. Oh, look at the doggy yogi. Looking froggy. Anyway, um, what's coming down the street? A C8. A Camaro. Yes, that 458 was nice, man. I love the air induction that goes behind that glass. 
and I have to take pride to say I was the first one to get the quarter glass out of one that burned down in the U.S. Got him at home. Oh man, I love to see a father. Is that his daughter or? I don't even care. Father and his kid, man. That's great. There's another one. Oh, no, nope, that's the wife. But I did see a uh, guy with his Audi. What is that, California? The guy with his Audi he brought his daughter out and she was helping him polish it up. Man, that was so nice. My man right here. Oop, I went Diddy style, my bad. That was a dog right there. So you got to change your phrases up now. You can't just be freestyling no more because things get associated. Four liter of money. I've seen this car before. I remember seeing her. I think she was in Palos Verdes. When he pulled up. I don't know if she's on that video. They pulled up next to a uh, career DT that was black. All right. Let's see what we got over here. There's an interesting Mustang over here too. That was a nice looking brown and it's for sale. Let's see if I can capture it, see if I can get dude's information. For those of you that might be interested in buying a custom Mustang. <sighs> and it's cold as hell out here. <laughs> it's gotta be at least 60 degrees, I think. But, I mean, hell, we're right here on the water. Middle of Malibu. Ah, oh, there we go. See, they were together. And that's his Audi right there, the white one. That was so cool to see him polishing it up together. Porsche community. Is that carbon? Yes, it is. Yes, it T.I. is. Supras. Close to that platinum color. Where's that Mustang? Oh, here we go. So here's a Mustang that is for sale. I don't know the owner. Oh, that's the owner right there. He's dressed to match his car brown. Roll cage. I didn't see that at first. Interior is really, really nice. I would have had to break up this interior, though. I mean, the I mean, the seats. Got to do a two-tone. Something. It's got to match the steering wheel, too. I would have had to. Oh, there's your phone number. For those that might be interested. I do not know how much it is. Let's see. Let me find out. Hold on a second. So, going price is $120. Let me get you in some sunlight. Could you sit as a root beer brown? That's just a regular metallic brown, though. It's not a, uh, a candy or a custom color or anything like that. $120, huh? I mean, you can build it for $120. Okay, man. Let's go check out some GT3s. Now I like this dude's Viper. The original ones. And he's got the snake on the side. I don't know if you guys know, but they've got different generations of the snake, which I thought was really cool that they did for Viper. But <clears throat> they're all different. So I don't know if you can see the snake by the door, the snake's head, the red dot, that's what that is. It's very subtle, but he did it really nice. And I love how they had the Viper in the tail light. Bat Viper. Interesting. I don't that's an odd combination. If you want to come back, you can. That is so badass. I love that tail light like that. That is so cool digital license plates man I really hope they don't make that mandatory I don't want to pay monthly for that what we got what we got what we got that is a C8 friends and family just like this guy here now I don't know if that was titanium exhaust this was a modified exhaust too oh man that sounded so good over there this guy was a guy that sounded good pulling up I'm gonna do a timeout until I see some trick. So like, I don't even know what the little vehicle is right here. I've never seen it before. That's something I would expect to see in another country. I'm gonna need to do that at different plates. I have no idea what this is. And how you even come about getting it to even register it. 
It's got Asian plates. Huh. How did that happen? Oh man, my hands are freezing. Where are you going for 58? Another lady driving. Look at that. Wee. One way to impress me. See how I did that? See what I did that there? Oh, look at this Aston Martin. That's like a uh, turquoise. No, that's a blue. Oh, man, that's really nice. Wow, that was pretty trick how they did that. That front carbon bumper is very, very expensive. I fixed one of those before. It was obliterated, too. That's something you guys remember. I really like how I look at certain cars. I'm like, I worked on that one. I worked on that one. I worked on that one. 488. Next to a 458. So the one on the right is its successor. And that is an Aston Martin I've never seen before. GT3 is what's making those noise over there, a white one. I don't know if you guys can see it, I can't. Ooh, what is that, what is that, what is that, what is that? That is, I don't know what that is. She was making these noises. Got a 993 coming in here. Last of the air cool family. What is going on over here? See some bling. Supercharged, huh? I'm not sure that Turbo that. guy myself. Yeah. It's an old school Ferrari pulling in. What was that? That made noise. Here. 993 sits really, really nice. Audi R8. A Huracan coming in. What is, oh, that's a McLaren, I think. It's on the other side of that van. McLaren was nice. Look at that. Very nice. He's sitting low, too. Oh, man, that is nice. All right, moving right along. They are not on the list. They're not playing around with that. Oh, that's a nice 488 over there. Yeah, yeah. Alright, time out. Dude! That's one of those, uh, those, uh, what do you call them? Uh, 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 Man, I can't think of what that is. Surfboards with the little rudders and stuff underneath. It's electric. I've never seen one out in a while. I think they're like six, seven thousand or something crazy. It's a Mondial Ferrari. That's old school. Look at that four seater. What we got? Huracan. I think this is a YouTuber. Let me not speak on that. I don't know. Straight put Malibu on the car, huh? Representing his hood, I guess. Doesn't sound too great though. Can't really co sign on that. Ferrari at 430. Don't do it, bro. That's how you mess up the whole scene, man. Lots of BMWs though. I mean, a lot. Comes at 488. See, watch his entrance. That's what you gotta do when you got a lower vehicle. See that? Take your time going in nice and smooth money in your pocket you'll mess up your carbon it doesn't have carbon in the front but if you had it b and w do the same thing look at that that's good watch the mclaren come got an f12 over there bentley gt3 uh oh mclaren's having a hard time might have to come see me bring the money <laughs> Let's see what we got. The 993 is making its way in here. 
Lots of Audis. They look like they were Sikhs. That's so nice. Red and gold, huh? Oh, see, he's got those safeguards underneath, which are very expensive. And I actually fixed a LaFerrari that had those. They really didn't protect that front clip at all. They charge by the piece, like $150 per section or something like that. So it can get pretty expensive to do your whole car in the front. I don't recommend it, and I'm just telling you that because for the amount of money you spend on it, you could just pay me to fix your car should you mess it up. Just learn how to drive. 993. Ladies again. Three sixty Medina. I haven't seen one of those in a long time. Good, good. In a long time. Gosh, some hand warmers. Okay, doing a timeout. Again, because I don't see anything special. Three's coming in. Oh man, you see that? See how strong that chassis was? Straight three wheeled it coming in like a low rider. Like nothing. Good luck getting an allocation for something like that. That's $300,000 plus. No, my bad. Yeah, that car, I think, we correct me if I'm wrong, is 300000 with a 200000 markup? Or the other way around. But you're going to spend five for that. And again, that's if you know somebody to get you an allocation. I heard a front clip scrape. That's in my mind. I go, ching, ching. These have the same uh, wheelbase of a Porsche, if I'm not mistaken. Pretty good car to strip down and make another car out of. I think the design sucks, but for the footprint and the performance of the car, I think you could really do something with it. I don't know how much they are, but you know, for a canvas to play with, not bad. I remember doing my homework on this car. See old school NSX. How much coming in? How much coming in? Yeah. Maintenance cycle is no joke on this car, boy. Ferrari got themselves together with the 430 timing chain, all kinds of stuff. 360 was kind of a nightmare. All right, got some old school coming in. Cadillac, Bel Air, some Chevy activity. Ooh -wee. Oh, man. What is that turquoise over there? McLaren? All right, time out, you guys. Just got an MSO. I think this is an MSO uh, McLaren. Really, really rare. With the hood scoop. Stupid expensive. Yeah, it sounds pretty good for exhaust to be underneath. Oh, he couldn't get in. Porsche was not on the list. Oh, that sounds really good to have exhaust in the center. Usually you don't get that kind of note. That's pretty crisp. I mean, with extra peas at the end. some Audi R8s. Rolando, you should have come. I mean, all right, all right. Now, I haven't seen any V10s yet. These are all eights from what I can hear. But have no fear. I'm sure they're coming. What's up with our lineup? See, I see a 488. It's an old school NSX. 458, got old school Viper again. Another C8, old school air cool Porsche. Look at that. Is that green for a mean machine? That's your screen. 944. I don't know what that yellow Ferrari is. Not my favorite flavor. Oh, that is nice. That is reflective. Oh, my old school Porsche. I missed that. That's what was making all that noise. Very nice. 
Lotus C8 and another Porsche. A few Porsches. Got a Cobra down there. Oh, I got another G3 over there. Blue one coming in. Go check out this Camaro real quick. Hey, don't get upset. Look at that. Look at the crowd just fiending. Look. They need more. They're craving. That's passion right there, folks. That's passion right there. All eyes over here. to be continued wow look at the size of those brakes man he's got carbon ceramic brakes on a Camaro oh my gosh somebody had a blank check what the heck what is this couples day I must say Uh, we have an ugly sweater day? Look at that car. Serenic On a Camaro. Alright, let's keep it moving. Let's go, let's go. Alright, it's holding up everything. Oh, it's all good, don't you? see these rims up close. I want to know how they were done. Powder coated or what? They call him a sin. Say what's good. Listen to it. I don't know what that is. I think that's paint. It's a little bit of fade in the corner. It could be powder coat. Oh, pretty good. Really good on distance. So I'm hunting back over here for a, uh, there's a Mercedes Gold Wing that I saw. Boy, look at that. 700 some horses. It's a GT2. Big boy. Oh, there's a Mercedes going in the back. There's a lot of money out here, man. Mercedes AMG, the green one back here. Another drive, bro. package. Look at that. Come on, bro. Hurry up. A lot of Aston Martins. Mercedes AMG. Another Aston Martin. I don't know why dudes drive with their doors open. Oh, wait a minute. I think yeah, I'll give him a pass. I think he has a fixed window. Which is another reason why I got to get my window to go down on the SLC because I'm not driving with it open and I'm not driving with it fixed. So, a lot of shocks in there. Yeah, I don't think you can put the window down on that. I think these are what, 300,000, half million, something like that? They're pretty expensive. 488. I like a white Ferrari. Of course, I like a white Porsche, too. There's another one across the street in blue. Look at that. They're everywhere. Everywhere. Man, that's a hell of a line over there. So if you're looking to come late, I don't even know what time it is because I'm on the phone. Like, good luck with some parking. some rally cars coming in all right nothing too spectacular let's go see what's parked and see what i can find
just on a side note, I will point out that I am at the end of the U.S. There's a Catalina Island right over there, straight ahead. I don't know if you guys can see that. I don't know if I can translate the video. That is Santa Monica over there. That whole strip that's protruding out, which they call a peninsula. I gotta go National Geographic. I gotta show my intellect. No, I'm just kidding. That water's gotta be a good 40 degrees. And that's the rest of Malibu up there. Keep going up there, you'll see Beyonce's house and uh, Jason Statham, all those cats. But that's further down the street. And that is Cali for you. And this is what I call church. Well, you don't hear his car at all. Almost like it's electric or something. Man, it makes me want to stand there. It's all nice and warm. So these are the flavors. So I don't see no V10 uh, Audis. That's the uh, Huracan Evo. All right. Oh, uh, V10. Here we go. I didn't hear it come in. You can sound the. I mean, here a really, really unique note. All the Aston Martins. What we got? What we got? Let's see. I don't think. Oh, that's my 993 that I like coming in. It's so nice. And you too could sit so nice for the right price. Oh, that's good Chevy trucks. Oh, that's the Aston Martin uh, SUV. I don't know if some of you guys have seen it. I really like the interior. I think I saw this one in a uh, car show down at Palos Verdes. The interior is pretty tight. I like it a lot. Nice attention to detail. Moving right along. Got this electric skateboard. So, woo, looks like 400 bucks. What we got? What we got? GTR? Yep. Woo. Wow, now that's a drone. See that? I ain't even seen a drone at a car show like that before. Looks like plan. We had to go see this Camaro Superchars. Uh huh. Some nice size headers. Why is he only got one wrapped? Kind of weird. Got the collectors wrapped though. That is a huge radiator. That's at least four inches, Mike. That's a lot of water. It's got three fans on that piece, homie. Oh, two fans for the radiator, one for the transmission cooler, most likely. Man, that's a lot of water, homie. So the brakes, that's a, what's a $20,000 option right there? Or more. Fellas, you can correct me if I'm wrong, but. Gotta have some coin for that one. I like the carbon fiber gauges. Let me show you what that looks like. Oh, it's a carbon fiber faceplate. Oh, wait, dog. I considered those actually. It's nice. Very nice, very nice. To be continued.
Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I thought I hit pause. So Elon showed up. These trucks are hideous, dude. I don't care what you put on it. Look at the size of the windshield wiper. That thing is hideous. That's an embarrassment. I'm sorry. 570. I was wondering what everybody was staring at. We got more Huracan activity. Another F430. SCO. Out of here pretty quick. Appetite needs to be satisfied. I really do wish I was in the show a little bit. See, everything is stock. That's why I get so excited about being creative. And I pull up. We've seen everything pretty much. I mean, unless you got something rare like the Goldwing Mercedes and the, this uh, McLaren. I think the only I, man, I gotta find out the limited numbers of these. Oh, this dude—they're the owners. Say, man, how many of these are available? Because these are rare. I know they are, right? Like how many? One fifty. One hundred fifty of them. That's yeah, my buddy's car. He's a. Uh, I don't know where he is. Yeah, it's Where's all good. Him? I just remember. I know that hood scoop is really rare. Yeah. It's all good. Very, very limited production. That hood scoop is ridiculously expensive. I forgot it's called Carbon. <laughs> I mean, it's not bad to have something that is only one of a hundred or so in the world. Because that's not just US, that's the world. So, I mean, that's pretty tight. But. Another 720 out there. Is that a pista? I just think that, you know, it's really cool when you have something custom. That is the jinkiest looking rock. It's mixed with American and German. Why do I know? It's a pista. I was right. It's sitting really, really high. But anyway, uh, the hair is really long and then the markings are really dark. That's why I know about the German versus American. The Germans are really dark gold looking. And Americans have long hair. Hey guys, please move. Hey guys, please. Say excuse me, bro. Don't, don't, don't say move. So that's what we just saw. I'm sorry, my car's gotta make a noise. Sharp piece that man, that's gotta be like four inches high. You've heard me say it, but that piece of front clip is $35,000. And I'm going to get one to play with one day. I got my eyes on one. And I'm going to shock you. Montana. I play with the idea of registering my car in Montana. They'll set up your LLC and everything for it. For 800 bucks, the whole thing. Registration cheap. But good luck trying to get insurance and still be living here in California. They wanted uh, $6,000 a year to register my, S register my SLC. I mean, my, uh, yeah, my super light, my bad. Oh, wow, the GT3 RS is really nice over there. Try to get it. You can hear it, though. It's a pretty cool color combination. McLaren sounded good pink rims I couldn't do pink at all on anything but it looked good in motion I give it to him I mean I wouldn't do it but it sounded pretty good but that's not compensation for pink not in the least what you doing bro some people just burn gas unnecessarily I don't know what kind of the oh that's an Akita I think that is a beautiful looking dog. 
It's almost like he's got black pearl or something. I gotta know. Is that an Akita? Yeah. Wow, that's a pretty dog. Yeah, he's just a puppy. Though. I've never seen one that color. Usually they're like light, like huskies. Yeah, they're these are rare color. Yeah. Oh, and a black. Oh, that's pretty. Now, if that El Camino makes it in here, like, how he get on the list, dog? See if he does a U turn. Now, the front lip of the uh, pista had to grow on me. This air induction had to grow on me. And it grew. That's the reason why I did my Porsche like this. <laughs> Of course, mine is more than just aerodynamics. Mine has oil cooling feature too. GG3 RS. guys doing u-turns in here what was that police show that had uh the chevy in it or is this the oldsmobile i don't know what let's see is he getting in kojak was it kojak the old tv show that had this car in it i used to watch it as a kid yep he must be on the list hey Motorcycles. Hey, all go for two weeks. We still have some restaurants. Make sure to stop by, grab yourself a drink, a burrito. Enjoy yourself. That's the main dude that runs the Malibu Autobahn. I forget his name. Dude, making lots of money doing it. He's been doing that a long time, so he's connected with a lot of guys that have the, uh, like, well, chrome plate at the, uh, Injectors. Anyway, he knows a lot of guys that um, own a lot of exotic cars, and he apparently is connected in the movie industry. And so, when they need to rent cars for movies or whatever, he uh, sets that up and brokers the cars. Sorry, guys, I was just looking for something. All right, I'm gonna do a timeout till I find something. But y'all, I think I'm gonna call it. I think you pretty much seen, oh, that is a beautiful dog, too. Wow. This is so expensive. What a beautiful color. All right, so on that soft tip, I think I'm going to go ahead and call it. I think you guys have seen everything that is out here. Because uh, I think we are pretty much on the uh, middle side of the show time. And it'll be over soon. And I got to get home work on the Impala yep I think you guys have seen everything so if you stayed this long appreciate your attention I hope I made it entertaining and it was kind of cool and uh, hope to see you guys next time